Kansas State Wildcats are preparing for their bowl game tonight. It is the Alamo Bowl this evening in San Antonio. K-State wants to win to get 10 wins and finish in the top 10. Jake Schlegel has the story. Take it away, Jake. For K-State, it's all about finishing the season with 10 wins and finishing in the top 10. You, you, you have a way that you approach uh, you know, each day of the week and the night before a game and the day throughout the game. You, you have a routine and you have certain things that, uh, that you know are important, that you feel at least that are important in your program. Both teams are coming off a loss, a loss that kept UCLA from winning the Pac-12 South and a loss that kept K-State from winning a share of the Big 12 title. I think Jim you know, probably asked himself the same question as I do. Uh, you know, is, is how well, uh, how mentally ready is uh, each member of your, of your football team. We've had a good week of practice. Uh, the young men are focused. Uh, they're anxious to play. I look forward to a, an exciting game, a, a well-played game. Two teams that I think play with a lot of integrity and class. And two teams that have the potential to score a lot of points. You know, I think we have to be good on our special teams. I'm sure they feel the same way. And, you know, defensively, you can't give up those big plays. You know, same things you hear, you know, week in and week out, but they're all true. You know, they all uh, manifest themselves into winning or, or losing. And Kansas State has played in the Alamo Bowl once before. They lost to Purdue in 1998. Bill Snyder is 7-7 seven seven in bowls. He could move to 8-7 and seven, or 7-8 seven and eight, after what could be his last game as coach at K-State. Jake will have more on that later.